hey guys welcome back to the next video and in this video i will give you a quick exercise and the exercise is pretty simple so in the previous video you have seen that uh, we have created the master items within the measures and uh, within the dimension also you can create it visualization we will see it in later but uh, i want to give you an exercise where you are creating the different measures if as well as dimensions if you have let's say any dimensions of your interest from the current data source then i would like that you create let's say average of sales or sum of profit and average of profit by creating the new measure similarly if you want to create any conditional dimension however we have not uh, touched on that subject that how we can create a calcul uh, calculated kind of a dimension which is a conditional one but you can create a simple one by simply selecting a dimension now that i have already explained so i look forward that you are creating the new measures and dimensions which is basically a practice of how to create a master item and then uh, we will use and then whatever dimension or measure i will create uh, i will going to use it in the subsequent videos and show you the action so you can do this practice and come back uh, for the next video and we will see a new topic.